Okay, I'm just sitting here, um, chilling out on a Sunday evening, uh, and I feel the need to share this. Okay, um, like most of us, when I was very, very young, you know, we're talking four, five, six, seven, yeah, I'm bred with a need to be accepted. Okay. I wanted to be accepted by my parents, my grandparents, my teachers, my brothers. Okay? And basically, they more or less said to me, especially my grandparents, they said to me, said to me if I do this, and they listed it, I will be accepted by them. Okay? So if I did it, I'd be accepted. And my need to be accepted, then I gave it my best try I possibly could have done. Okay, so I tried. Boy, did I try. And I tried again. Okay. But my dyslexia, looking back on it now, because when I was younger, they didn't, the term ADHD didn't exist. But I had ADHD. Um, Asperger's slash autism spectrum, I was on it. And those things meant that I couldn't. I couldn't meet the requirements of the teachers, my parents, my grandparents to be accepted. Especially my grandparents. Mm. They rejected me. That's what it felt like to me. I couldn't meet the terms of their acceptance. So I felt rejected. And we're talking a young age here. We're talking 10, 11, 12. Trust me, this is a world of hurt. Okay? And I've met other 16, 17 year olds in this world, and they're in the same place, in a world of hurt. It is not a bad place, good place. It's a sad lonely, dark place. But I didn't give in to my anger. I don't know why, but I didn't. Maybe there's something. I don't know. I don't know. I, I do know as I got older, the key to not giving in to my anger was meeting my wife, Debbie. Without her, I could have given in to anger. But I didn't. Instead, I have spent my life seeking peace. And what I've done, and th th obviously I'm talking straight from the heart here, so it's not flowing like it normally would. Uh, and I found that peace basically by making myself emotionally self-reliant okay emotional self-reliance has helped me find my peace I now have a um, great relationship with my parents I'm, I'm, the anger's gone I'm happy I'm content and I'm starting to feel like I am starting to understand who I stand for, what I stand for, and what my life is meant to be. Okay? So for any of you guys out there, any of you 16, 17, 18 year olds, who in a world are hurt, all I can say is, all I can share is being there it is horrible. But the answer is not anger and is not hate. It is emotional self-reliance. To be emotionally self-reliant. Okay. That's it. Straight from the heart. Um, I guess putting this out in the world. I hope it helps someone. Okay. Gotta go now. <laughs> Alright. Bye.